what is going on YouTube I am germ here today we have a really big story to cover actually I mean um, I think it's a pretty big story I could see how some people uh, are maybe not gonna think it's that big of a deal but either way it's kind of a follow-up on uh, another story that I have talked about previously this one today is obviously surrounding wonder um, in the top lane for G2 obviously he still does have a year on his contract but he is a guy that has received a lot of backlash for his play in both the spring playoffs and in the summer playoffs um, you know G2 is a team who for the past couple of years they've been known for having the best or one of the best players at every single position in Europe and some of the best players at every single position in the world and obviously a lot of people would say um, that the 2021 version of Wonder was not that and um, while I think it's unfair to blame you know uh, their downcomings on him I, I think it is fair to say he is the most clear member that uh, maybe they're going to be looking to upgrade I think top lane is very very hard to upgrade in Europe um, but again they do have a couple of options um, wonder is a big enough player big enough personality big enough resume to actually sell off and get some money um, but there is a piece of news that came out today that actually is an, a very very interesting update to his situation that's what we're going to be talking about so definitely drop a like if you guys do enjoy this video I would appreciate it so so much uh, subscribe to tip today and all my latest content again we're still on that road to 10k we're getting closer and closer I think we're sitting at 8200 right now uh, last couple of weeks have been crazy I hope the next couple of weeks are even crazier and consider checking out my patreon patreon.com slash I am German with that being said let's get right into this um, so the big update the big piece of news that I want to talk about again maybe I'm making a bigger deal out of this than it should be maybe it's a meme maybe it's a joke maybe not but um uh, either way I think it, these discussions are still going to be had these discussions are still going to go around what we're talking about is a post from the G2 subreddit but this is my YouTube video. I took a screenshot from the G2 subreddit and tweeted it. So um, this is going to be my little, you know, plug for my Twitter account, which is at I underscore am underscore germ. I tweet all the time. Um, it's one of the easiest and best ways to, um, you know, actually get in touch with me. If you have something to say to me, the Patreon, I respond to every single message. Uh, Twitter DMs, I respond to most messages. If you tweet at me, I'll for sure see it. Um, but definitely follow me. I tweet out all kinds of stuff, you know, surrounding my life, League of Legends, new updates. Updates, rumor speculation news all of that stuff um, I think I'm a decent follow I don't know uh, I would love to run those numbers up as well but what I tweeted out here again is a screenshot from the G2 subreddit from Baron burn um, I just tweet out like the sweating faces I got 10 likes I feel like 10 likes is decent wonder name changed to unemployed top now obviously wonder is a memer he's a guy who likes to joke a lot g2 players they're all memers they all like to joke a lot um this is part of the reason why the team and the players have been so likable why they've had such a big fan base not only um because they've been good because they've had results but um you know they do really really well in social media they do really well with fans they do um really well at, at taking things very seriously and being very competitive but also you know not taking themselves too seriously at the same time um not taking the competition too seriously um so this could definitely be a meme, you know, him just kind of making fun of the rumors and everything that's going around. But again, he now has the splice icon. He doesn't have G2 icon. He has changed his name to unemployed top laner. Um, does that mean that uh, him and G2 have had some conversations? Does that mean that he knows his name is being thrown around in, you know, sale talks? Um, does that mean that he expects or maybe that he knows he will not be returning to G2 next year? Now, again, uh, speaking in that regard, some of the names we're being, uh, you know, hearing being thrown around um really vitality is one of the biggest names that, that i've heard coming up time and time again as a rumor now um, vitality is going to have an interesting roster obviously they just re-signed self-made um there's rumors that they'll have a pretty nasty bot lane either way they have crown shot um people expect leader to come back but top lane was a very very real issue for vitality um last year obviously slt was supposed to come in and be kind of their new up-and-coming guy but that didn't work out. You know, SLT didn't have the split that Adam had. Um, and then Segenda came back and he was okay, but... Um you know, Vitality, we keep hearing that they have all this money to throw around, that they want to make a super team. They're going to be in contact with a lot of these G2 members. Maybe they'll even buy out Mickey to pair with Crown Shot. Who knows? But um, it does seem like the most, uh, if G2 does decide to get rid of Wonder, if Wonder is not on G2 in 2022, um, it does seem like at this point, the most landing, the most likely landing spot for him is Vitality. And, um, you know, again, this is something new. This is um, something he newly did. I think it's funny for a couple of reasons. One, it means that Wonder was even logged into League of Legends and he was even potentially playing solo queue in the offseason um, which obviously a lot of people know is going to be kind of a, a little bit of a rare occurrence for him um, but it also could mean that there are updates going on again a lot of people are saying how 
we need to wait we need to wait till november for the off season to get going blah 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 and i agree with that to an extent obviously not too much can be going on um people can't really be reaching out to g2 players unless uh g2 has given them their okay but G2 can have conversations with their own players, and that's very possible. G2 is in offseason mode 100%. You think Carlos hasn't started thinking about his 2022 roster yet? I guarantee you Carlos started thinking about his 2022 roster as soon as they lost that series to Fnatic, probably as soon as it went to Game 5. It was at least, you know, turning a little bit, uh, especially once they didn't make it to MSI. They've probably been thinking about stuff for so, so long, and obviously they can start to have these conversations with the players like, hey, um we're thinking about getting rid of you. We're thinking about selling you off. We think it's best, you know, if, if for us both, if we split apart, um, you know, maybe what teams would you like to go to? Maybe what are you thinking? Uh, maybe do you, you know, what, what, who would you like to talk to? Teams are trying to reach out to you. Here's who's interested in you. You know, maybe some of that stuff has happened. Now it could also be that wonder is not an idiot and sees the writing on the wall and sees, um, you know, here's all the rumors, here's the news. Um, and just kind of has the feeling that he could be gone because the G2 players know, they know this was a terrible year. They know Carlos wants to make some changes they know carlos expects and demands better of his team so uh, again there's a bunch of different ways that this could go i could absolutely see um if you took this uh you know wonder changing his name as just being a meme as just being a joke but i, I really think there is something to it i think um this is kind of a, a very very big and very very obvious sign um and i think a lot of people kind of needed and wanted to see it um just as far as that you know zers replied and said who called that um because zers had previously tweeted out that he heard that g2 was most likely going to be replacing wonder um, again in that uh, conversation for top laners for g2 there's a couple names being thrown around the most likely is broken blade is the name that keeps popping up is a name that um, people are saying is you know kind of like the odds on favorite even more likely than wonder to be the top laner for g2 next year um, arma is kind of being thrown around in those discussions alfari again i talked about it in a video yesterday a little bit but i i think that is very very unlikely but some people are trying to throw that name around as well um Again, I have talked about this a little bit before. I, I This is a joke. You know, I said I only post 100% facts, and I tweeted out uh, the G2 to Kick Wonder video that I made two weeks ago where I covered um, the tweets from Zers. And, and, and it's not just Zers. It's a couple of other people in the community as well, um, you know, who have been speculating about G2 potentially looking to move on from Wonder. Um, so, again, he knows all this stuff. He sees all this stuff. Um, and potentially there are other conversations going on behind the scenes. Um, and who knows how Wonder feels about this. Maybe, you know, he's excited for a new opportunity. Maybe there's some other team he really wants to go to maybe he really wants to go cash out there's always the north american possibilities and opportunities as well because he's definitely going to be getting some some big offers from north american teams as well so he's going to get to decide whether he wants to stay in europe whether he wants to go to north america whether he wants to be on a team that maybe has a chance to be better next year or if he wants to maximize dollars you know th there's still going to be a ton of options open for wonder because this guy has an insane resume uh msi champion world finalist world semi-finalist however many time domestic champion just because he had a bad year in terms of g2 standards doesn't mean mean he had a bad year in terms of you know everyone's standards he'd be a very very good player for uh you know clg or, or something um even vitality who'd be a significant upgrade over what they have going on but um i did just want to get this story out to you guys i think it is a very very big update in the wonder situation again it was exploding on uh the g2 subreddit it got me 10 likes on twitter so i had to get it out to you guys as well but that is pretty much it for this video today definitely drop a like if you guys did enjoy it i would appreciate it so so much leave a comment down below uh where do you think wonder will be playing in 2022 do you think he's coming back to g2 do you think he's unemployed um i would love to hear your guys thoughts and opinions subscribe save today and all my latest content hopefully catch you guys in the next one but until then peace